Cupid doesn't have wings, he rides a vivid black Harley Davidson. It's a premium color now. Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. My name is Sean, this is UCM Pigs Moto Vlogs, and welcome to the VD Express 2024. That's right, today is January 29th, it is a brisk 45 degrees, and we're heading out for a two-hour road trip to Valentine's, Virginia. I've got some Valentine's in the tour pack to send out to some awesome people. And don't forget, all leftover monies from this trip on postage, uh, I'll be sending to Tunnels to Tower via the Baggers and Brews fundraiser. Now, before we get started, let me remind you to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always on my channel, if you don't feel like typing words, just leave me an emoji. Let me know you're here. I would greatly appreciate that. All right, y'all, real quick update. Um, $91 left over from the VD Express 2024. So this money, as I mentioned, I'm going to make a donation to Tunnel to Towers via the Baggers and Brews fundraiser. So we're going to go ahead and make it an even 100, and I'm going to be donating to those guys. There will be a link in the description if you would like to go donate. Um, if you missed the VD Express 2024, go hit their link, go watch their videos. It'll be in the description so you can give to this awesome, awesome um fundraiser i'd like to thank the people that participated in vd express 2024 so let's do that real quick and the people that donated to this cause so that's road glide andy um mr mcstash jason uh ben from bikes beards and brews uh dale the wondering yankee mike from ace cafe bikes uh thank you guys for participating and also for my guest in this video which i'm getting ready to announce which is my friend rob and stacy from kelp fire who joined me on the ride so let's get back to that ride so you guys can see how the day went so i'm heading out i'm just leaving the p.o box for the last time and i'm heading out to suffolk virginia and i'm going to meet up with a couple folks i'm going to meet up with my friend rob rob's ridden with me before he recently just got a gopro he's thinking about toying around with this so we're going to see how that goes and i'm meeting up with the infamous kelp fire uh, she is coming down from a little north of me and going to ride out with me as well i think her husband fat Glide, might come along we'll see when we get there so it's going to be kind of boring right now so i'm going to shut the cameras off i got to scoot on down and meet them i might be running us a little bit late so we're going to make up for some time and i'll talk to y'all in just a little bit All right, y'all, so we just left the Huddle House in Suffolk, Virginia. Um, I did not break the cameras out because, you know, this is my first time meeting Kelp Fire, and there she is right there. I don't know if you can see in the rearview mirror. We'll get some footage of her here in a little bit. Um, I always like to just get to know people and stuff before I go shoving a camera in their face. So I got also got my buddy Rob. He's back there on his beautiful uh, CVO Road Glide, and we've got about an hour and a half out to Valentine's. So we're getting ready to buckle down here on uh, US 58. Uh, watch out for the cops because if you're not familiar with US 58 here in Virginia, it is a speed trap. So we're going to take it nice and easy and get out there. I'll get a little B-roll on the way out and maybe we'll do some clowning around on camera once we get to Valentine's. So we'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Sit tight, enjoy the ride, and we'll see you in Valentine's.
along here. I don't know how good my audio is going to be because it is super windy. But uh, gazing at these clouds, Road Reality likes clouds, so I hope he can appreciate these clouds. Okay, so we just left Emporia, Virginia. We all had to stop and uh, have a pee break. So now we've got about 26 minutes to Valentine's. It's back roads the rest of the way, so hopefully I can get a little more B-roll. We're getting ready to cross over, uh, I think that's I-95 down there. Yep, I-95, you go to Florida that way. Um, so back roads the rest of the way. Been a great ride. Uh, it warmed up to be about 50 degrees. It's still a little cold, you know, on the bike running you know 70 miles an hour but just like previous years uh, I've been lucky on this ride uh, typically in the upper 40s low 50s a little overcast today but the Sun is peeping through so it's turned out to be a beautiful day so there's your YouTube weather forecast that no video is complete without that so let's get on down the road and we will talk again in Valentine's unless we see something interesting on the way have made it to the big town of Valentine's, Virginia. And there's the post office. y'all so we just left the post office we're now heading back to Emporia Virginia we're gonna stop at Huddle House get us a cup of coffee warm up a little bit a little something to eat and then I think we're all gonna cut our separate ways I know Stacy is going to uh, head a little more due north um, instead of coming down in the Hampton Road she was kind enough to ride about an hour to come down to Suffolk and meet me Rob and I will probably ride back towards Hampton Roads and he lives on the other side of the water so he'll go that way so we're gonna scoot on down this little sketchy road um, the lady at the post office told me to go this way and we'll talk to you guys in a little bit Alright, we're leaving the Huddle House. Felt Fire's getting on a motorcycle. And that's gonna wrap up this video. So we'll close it out here in a few minutes. minutes. Wave goodbye to the, to the YouTube people. <laughs> but that's my ride out to Valentine's, Virginia. I hope you guys enjoyed. I really enjoyed coming out. I enjoyed uh, hanging out with Rob and Kelp Fire. And uh, it was a really good day for a ride. It actually warmed up into the mid 50s. So uh, we're making our way back toward the coast. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your week, and I hope you have a great weekend coming up. And until we talk again, you guys be careful. You guys be safe. Always keep your shiny side up, and we'll talk to you next time.